Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to teach you 40 um, Turkish essential verbs and in some different forms of imperative, negative, and I'm going to give you at least two expressions or a daily um, usual used uh, usually used sentences. So you'll be more familiar uh, with the expressions and the usage of the verb. Okay, let's go through them. And please, um, before start, uh, these 40 verbs, I mean, will not remain in your mind now unless you take notes. So uh, please have a notebook for all the lessons that I'm uh, providing here. Take your notes and try to repeat them as much as possible uh, so you will learn the language better. The more you practice, the perfect you become. Okay. We have the verb gelmek in infinitive form, which means to come. Gel or Gelsene. Gel, gelsene. Means come. It's an imperative uh, form uh, which you use for singular uh, subject. And what's the difference between gel and gelsene? This sene suffix uh, is kind of insisting or it kind of um, it gives a kind of meaning that like I'm waiting, hurry up. Is is um how can I say impression uh, to force a little bit on the meaning of the word? Like what are you waiting for? Why don't you do that? Oh, come on! It adds a meaning like come on, do it. Okay. And we have it in uh, plural and singular form. Here is the singular. You had it. Now we are going to have the plural form. Geliniz or gelin. Only gelin might be enough. It's in speaking uh, daily language. We say gelin. Um, more politely will be giliniz. This is a kind of written language, let's say. And galsenize. Here, senize has also the meaning of come on, what are you waiting for? And it means come. We use it for the plural subject. Galme. Galme means don't come. And that is for singular form. Gelmeyin or gelmeyiniz means don't come for plural subject and uh, gelmeyin is mostly used in speaking language and gelmeyiniz is used in instructions of written language. Gel yanıma. Gel yanıma means come to me gelme üstüme gelme üstüme it means stop criticizing me okay these are expressions some of them are normal daily sentences and some of them are expressions Gitmek means to go. Git or gitsene means go. Gidiniz or gidin. And gitsenize means go. Gitme. Don't go for singular. Gitmeyin or gitmeyiniz means don't go. Git Allah aşkına. Git Allah aşkına. 
means go for God's sake. Allah aşkına means for God's sake. Gitme ne olur? It means please don't go. Ne olur means um, it's a question, uh, questional phrase, and but it means please. I mean, what happens if you don't? I mean, nothing big will happen if you do me a favor. It has a kind of meaning. Okay. Yemek. To eat. Ye. Yesene. Means eat. Plur. Um, what's the imperative? Yiyen. Yiyiniz. Or. Yesenize. Means eat. What are you waiting for? Yeme. Don't eat. Yemeyin. Or yemeyiniz. Don't eat. For plural. Yemezler. Yemezler. That means you can't fool me. I, I won't believe you. I don't buy it. Like literally it means um, nobody eats that. It means that I don't buy it. Yiyecek. Yiyecek means food. Oturmak. Oturmak. To sit. Otur. Otursana. Sit. Oturun. Oturunuz. Otursanıza. Means sit. Oturma. Oturma. Means don't sit. Oturmayın. Oturmayınız. Means don't sit for plural. Otur yanıma. Otur yanıma. Sit beside me. Burada oturma. Burada oturma. Means don't sit here. Yürümek. Yürümek means to walk. Yürü. Yürüsene means walk. Yürüyünüz. Yürüyün. Or yürüsenize means walk. Yürüme. Yürüme means don't walk. Yürümeyin. Yürümeyiniz. Means don't walk for plural. Yürü git. Yürü git. Means go. Yürüyüş yapmak. Yürüyüş yapmak. Means going for a walk. We had the um, verb conjugation of yapmak in a different video. Please go and check and you will learn all tenses as well. And you can practice all the verbs um, going through those tenses. Of course, I'm going to have more videos on them, but anyway, you can practice these verbs. İçmek. İçmek. To drink. İç. İçsene. Means drink. İçin, içiniz, içsenize, means drink for plural, içme, içme, means don't drink, içmeyin, 
İçmeyin is. Means don't drink for plural. İçki içer misin? İçki içer misin? We would you like to have a drink? But this drink, içki, is an alcoholic drink. İçecek. İçecek. That's a noun form of drink. We call it to any drink. So içecek can be any drink, but içki is alcoholic drink. Gülmek. Gülmek. It means to laugh. Gül. Gülsene. Means laugh. Gülün. Gülünüz. Gülsenize. Means laugh. Gülme. Gülme. Means don't laugh. Gülmeyin. Gülmeyiniz. Means don't laugh for plural. Gülüş. Gülüş. Means laughter is the noun form of gül. Gülme bana. Gülme bana. Means don't laugh at me. Gülümsemek. Gülümsemek. Means to smile. Gülümse. Gülümsesene. It's an imperative for a smile. Gülümseyin. Gülümseyiniz. Gülümse. Gülümsesenize. Means a smile. Gülümseme. Gülümseme. Means don't laugh. Gülümsemeyin. Gülümsemeyiniz. Means don't laugh for plural. Gülümse bakayım. Gülümse bakayım. Means smile now. Let me see your smile. Gülümse ne olur? Gülümse ne olur? Means please smile. İzlemek. İzlemek. Means to watch. İzle. İzlesene. Means watch. İzleyin. İzleyiniz. İzlesenize. Again, means watch. İzleme. İzleme. Means don't watch. İzlemeyin. İzlemeyiniz. Means don't watch for plural. İzle beni. İzle beni. Watch me. İzlemesen de olur. İzlemesen de olur. You can choose not to watch. İzlemesen means if you don't watch. De means to. Like also. Olur means it's okay. So it's okay if you don't even watch. Bakmak. Bakmak. Means to look. Bak. Baksana. Means look. Bakınız. Bakınız. Baksanıza. Baksanıza. Again means look. Bakma. Bakma. Means don't look. Bakmayın. Bakmayınız means don't look for plural. Bana bak. Bana bak means look at me. 
But this Banabak has kind of a threat kind of meaning. Like when they uh, want to start a fight or something, they say Banabak or it means like, listen, hey, yo, yeah, kind of meaning. Bakalım ne olacak? Bakalım ne olacak? Means let's see what comes up. Dinlemek. It means to listen. Dinle. Dinlesene. Means listen. Imperative form. Dinleyin. Dinleyiniz. Dinlesenize. Means listen in plural form. Dinleme. Dinleme means don't listen. Dinlemeyin. Dinlemeyiniz means don't listen. Dinle beni. Dinle beni means listen to me. Dinleme sen de olur. Dinleme sen de olur. Because you can choose not to listen. It's okay even if you don't listen. Dinlemesen de olur. Silmek. Silmek means to clean or to delete. Sil. Silsene means clean or delete. Silin, siliniz, silsenize, again means clean, actually delete is better for this one, silme, silme means don't clean or don't delete, silmeyin, silmeyiniz, Means don't clean. Sil hepsini. Means delete all. Sil hepsini. Hiçbir şeyi silme. Means don't delete anything. Hiçbir şeyi silme. Don't delete anything. İstemek. To want or to ask, meaning want. It doesn't mean like asking a question. It's like asking for like wanting. İste. İstesene. Means ask. İsteyin. İsteyiniz. İstesenize. Means ask. İsteme. İsteme. Means don't ask, don't want. İstemeyin. İstemeyiniz. Means don't ask. İstesende. İstemesende. Means whether you want or not. İstemeden oldu. İstemeden oldu. It means it happened unintentionally. Duymak. Duymak. Means to hear. Duy. Duysana. It's an imperative means hear. Duyun. Duyunuz. Duysanıza means hear. Duyma. Duyma. Don't hear. Duymayın. Duymayınız. 
Again, don't hear. Duymazdan gel. Duymazdan gel. It means ignore hearing or pretend that you didn't hear such a thing. Duyamıyorum sizi. Duyamıyorum sizi. It means I can't hear you. Usually hear that. This or uh, use this sentence while um you know there's a voice interruption on phone or there's a problem video chat or something. Okay. If you put diomiyorum seni, it means that you don't hear and you're um addressing one person. But diomiyorum size, you are addressing more than one person. Başlamak. Başlamak. If you have noticed, we are going through the words that we uh, use the thick vowels for them. In the first part of the video, we had the one with thin voice, uh, thin um, vowels. Now here we have the thick vowels. Okay. Başlamak means to start. Başla. Başlasana means start başlayınız başlasanıza means start for plurals başlama başlama means don't start başlamayın başlamayınız Again means don't start. Hadi başla. Hadi başla. Means come on, start. Hadi means come on. Başlamak lazım artık. Başlamak lazım artık. It means it's time to start. Bitirmek. Bitirmek means to finish, to end something, to finish something. Bitir, bitirsene. It's an imperative to say finish. Bitirin, bitiriniz. Bitirsenize. Again means finish. Bitirme, bitirme. Means don't finish. Bitirmeyin. Bitirmeyiniz. Again means don't finish. Bittim ben. Bittim ben. Means I'm done. I'm dead. Bitirelim şu işi. Bitirelim şu işi. Means let's finish this. Vermek. Vermek. Means to give. Ver. Versene. Is an imperative to give. Verin. Veriniz. Versenize. Again, means give. Verme. Verme. Don't give. Vermeyin. Vermeyin. Or vermeyin is. That means don't give for plural. Verdim gitti. Verdim gitti. It means I'll give it to you or I've already given that to you. They use this random gitti when they um, propose. When a family of a guy is proposing uh, to the family of a girl for marriage. And if the answer is yeah, the father of the 
bride will usually say verdim gitme gitti. It means um yeah, she's yours. I gave her to you. Ver bakayım. Ver bakayım. Means give it to me. I want to have a look. Açmak. Açmak. Means to open. Aç. Açsana. Again means open. But the imperative form. Açın. Açınız. Açsanıza. Again means open. Imperative form. Açma. Açma. Means don't open. Açmayın. Açmayınız. Again means don't open. Kapıyı aç. Kapıyı aç. Means open the door. İçim açıldı. İçim açıldı. Means of, I feel fresh. Like from inside. I feel my heart is fresh. I feel my soul fresh. Kapatmak. Means to close. Kapat. Kapatsana. Again means to close. Kapatın. Kapatınız. Kapatsanıza. Again mean close. It's an imperative for plural. Kapatma. Kapatma. Means don't close. Kapatmayın. Kapatmayınız. Again means don't close for plural. Konuyu kapat. Konuyu kapat. Means end the conversation. As end the topic or change the topic or don't talk about it anymore. Kapat çeneni. Kapat çeneni. That means shut up. Kalmak. Kalmak means to stay. Kal. Kalsana. Again means stay. Kalın. Kalınız. Kalsanıza. Again means stay for plural. Kalma. Kalma. Means don't stay. Kalmayın. Kalmayın. Kalmayınız. Means don't don't say. Kaldım. Kaldım bir başıma. <gülüyor> Kaldım bir başıma. It means I'm left alone. Or I was left alone. Both of them are correct depending on the situation. Böyle vaka kaldım. Böyle vaka kaldım. Means I just stared. Vaka kaldım means I, I, just, I just looked and didn't say anything. I stayed, I remained looking at something. Kullanmak. Kullanmak. Means to use. Kullan. Kullansana. Use. Kullanın. Kullanınız. Kullansanıza. Kullanma. Kullanma. Means don't use. Kullanmayın. Kullanmayın. Means don't use for plural. Kullanabilirsin. Kullanabilirsin. 
means you can use. Seni kullanıyorlar. Seni kullanıyorlar. It means they are taking advantage of you. Düşünmek. Means to think. Düşün. Düşünsene. Again means think. Düşününüz. Or düşünün. Düşünsenize. Düşünsenize. Means think. Düşünme. Düşünme. Means don't think. Like don't think about it. Don't worry. Düşünmeyin. Düşünmeyiniz. Means don't think. Düşünceli. Düşünceli. That's thoughtful. Düşünmem lazım. Düşünmem lazım. Means I have to think. Atmak. Atmak. Means to throw. Atsana. Atsana. At. Atsana means throw. Atın. Atınız. Atsanıza. Atsanıza. Again means throw. Atma. Atma. Means don't throw. Atmayın. Atmayınız. Again, that's don't throw. Bana attılar. Bana attılar. That means they sold it to me. Doing a fraud. Like they sold it like much more expensive than me or the quality was not good. Atıyorum. Means for example. When you see they use atıyorum in the middle of the conversation. They are uh, giving an example. Bırakmak. Bırakmak means to leave, to quit. Sorry, to quit. Bırak. Bıraksana means leave or stop holding it. Bırakın. Bırakınız. Bıraksanıza. Means leave. Or stop sticking to it. Bırakma. Bırakma. Means don't leave. Or don't like. Um, don't let it go. Okay. Bırakmayın. Bırakmayınız. Again means don't leave. Bırak şunu. Bırak şunu. Again means leave it, let it go. Bırak gitsin. Bırak gitsin. It means let it go. Söylemek. Söylemek. It means to say. Söyle. Söylesene. Again we say. Söyleyin. Söyleyiniz. Söylesenize. Again we say. Explain. Söyleme. Don't say. Söylemeyin. Söylemeyiniz. Again means don't say or don't tell. Doğru söyle. Doğru söyle. Means tell the truth. 
Doğruyu söyle. Ya yeah, both of them are correct. Yalan söyleme. Yalan söyleme. Means don't tell lies. Demek. Demek means to tell. De. Desene. Means tell. Deyiniz. Deyin. Desenize. Again, tell or say. But as tell and say, you know, they have different usage in Turkish and uh, English language. They have kind of the same situation in uh, Turkish, but they don't match exactly what is in English. So, deme. Deme. Like, don't tell. Demeyin. Demeyin. Demeyin is. Again means don't tell. Demek öyle. Demek öyle. So it means so. That's why blah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Demedi deme. Demedi deme. It means I'm telling you now. Later, don't say that. Nobody told me anything. So, all of these means demedi deme. Guys, don't forget to take notes. These are a lot. Beklemek. It means to wait. Bekle. Beklesene. Means wait. Bekleyin. Bekleyiniz. Beklesenize. Again means wait. Bekleme. Don't wait. Beklemeyin. Beklemeyiniz. Again, don't wait. Çok beklersin. Çok beklersin. It means you'll wait forever. Oh my. Let me check this. Okay. There. Biraz bekler misin? Biraz bekler misin? It means can you wait a little bit? Biraz means a little bit. Bekler misin means would you wait for me or can you wait for me please? Yatmak. It means to lie down. Yat. Yatsana. Again means to lie down. Yatın. Yatınız. Yatsanıza. Again means to lie down. Yatma. Yatma. Don't lie down. Yatmayın. Yatmayınız. Again, don't lie down. Yatılı misafir. Yatılı misafir. That's a guest who stays for a night. Like your friend comes and stays for the night. So she is a yatılı misafir. Yatak. Yatak. It means bed. Uyumak. Uyumak. Means to sleep. Uyu. Uyusana. Means sleep. Imperative form. Uyuyunuz. Or uyuyun. Uyusanıza. Again means sleep. Uyuma. Uyuma. Means don't sleep. Uyumayın. 
uyumayınız. Can means don't sleep. Uyumam lazım. Uyumam lazım. Means I have to sleep. Uyku. Uyku. And that's sleep in noun form. Görüşmek. That's to meet. Görüş. Görüşsene. Again means meet. It has another meaning. It is like if you make a phone call and like have a contact with someone, you still use this verb as well. Görüşün. Görüşünüz. Görüşsenize means meet or have a call. Görüşme. Görüşme. Again means don't meet. Görüşmeyin. Görüşmeyiniz. Again means don't meet. Görüşünüz. Sorry. Görüşürüz. Görüşürüz means see you. Goodbye. They use this görüşürüz to say goodbye. And that means see you. Görüşelim. Means let's meet up. When somebody says görüşelim, it doesn't mean that let's have a phone call, let's talk together. But when they tell you to talk to someone else, they will say görüşsene. Kind of. Okay, göndermek. Göndermek means to send. Gönder. Göndersene. Send. Gönderin. Gönderiniz. Göndersenize. Can mean send in plural form. Gönderme. Gönderme. Means don't send. Göndermeyin. Göndermeyiniz. Again means don't send. Gönder gelsin. Gönder gelsin. It means send him to me. Like send a person to come to see me. Mesaj gönder. Mesaj gönder. Means send a message. Getirmek. Getirmek. It means to bring. Getir. Getirsene. It means bring. Getirin. Getiriniz. Getirsenize. Again means to bring. Getirme. Getirme. Means don't bring. Getirmeyin. Getirmeyiniz. Again means don't bring. Getirdiğin şeyler. Getirdiğin şeyler. Means things you brought. Saf sefalar getirdiniz. Sefalar getirdiniz. Means welcome. Um, this welcome is used when somebody comes to your place, okay? So you can use it as a singular verb or plural verb like this. So you can say sefalar getirdin for singular or sefalar getirdin is for plural. Bilmek. Bilmek means to know. Bil. Bilsene. It means know. Actually, they don't use bilsene, but anyway. Bilin. Biliniz. Bilsenize. 
bilme means don't know, like you shouldn't know. Let's not know, kind of. Bilmeyin, bilmeyiniz. Again, means don't know as an imperative. Çok biliyorsun. Çok biliyorsun. Means you know it all. It's like making fun of someone. It's like, oh yeah, you know all the things. Kind of expression. Biliyor musun? Biliyor musun? It means do you know? Like, do you know how it works? Or do you know this address? Or do you know whatever? Do you have information? Or do you know how to work with this? Görmek. Görmek means to see. Görsene. Gör. Görsene. Again means say. Görün. Görünüz. Görsenize. Again means say. Görme. Means don't say. Görmeyin. Görmeyiniz. Again don't say in plural form. Görürsün sen. Görürsün sen. It means you'll see. And that's a kind of threat, whether like in a joke between friends or um, a threat like that I'll show you. Görüyor musun? Görüyor musun? Means do you see this? Like, do you see what's happening? Kesmek. Kesmek means to cut. Kes. Kessene. Kesin. Kesiniz. Kessenize. Can means cut. Kesme. Don't cut. Kesmeyin. Kesmeyiniz. Again means don't cut. Kes sesini. That means shut up. Hesabı kes. It means in the relation. Like if it's a relation at work, if it is a um, this is an uh, imperative. Um, like if we use it as an infinitive, like hesabı kesmek, it's like. Uh, paying you all the uh, money you have, I mean, the company owes you and let you go. Like, they sack you. Okay. I hope nothing like that happens. Almak. Almak means to buy, to get, to take. All of them. Al. Al. Mm -hmm. Al sana. Again means get it, take it. Alın. Alınız. Alsanıza. Again means get it, take it. Alma. Means don't take it. Almayın. Almayınız. Again means don't take Satın almak. Satın almak means to buy. Alır mısınız? Alır mısınız? It means take it, please. Götürmek. Götürmek. It means to take. Götür. Götürsene. Again, it means to take it. Götürün. Götürünüz. Götürsenize. Again, means take. Götürme. 
Götürme. Means don't take. Götürmeyin. Götürmeyin. Al götür bunları. Al götür bunları. It means take them away. Götürdün mü? Götürdün mü? It means did you take it? Or did you take them? Sevmek. Sevmek. Means to love, to like something. Sev. Sevsene. It means love. Or um, not love. It's like, like touching, like patting, like patting an animal. They use it as patting an animal as well. Seven. Seven is. Sevsen is a. Again, love. Sevme. Sevme. And that's don't love. Sevmeyin. Sevmeyin is. Again, don't love. Seviyorum. Seviyorum. That means I like or I love. Sevmiyorum. Sevmiyorum. Like, I don't like. Bulmak. Bulmak. Means to find. Bul. Bulsana. Means find. Bulun. Bulunuz. Bulsanıza. Can means find. Bulma. Don't find. Bulmayın. Bulmayınız. Again, don't find. Buldun mu? Buldun mu? Like, did you find it? Bulamadım. Bulamadım. Again, I couldn't find. Aramak. It means to search or to look for or to make a call. Ara. Arasana. It means call. Make a call. Arayın. Arayınız. Arasanıza. Arama. Arama. Don't call. Aramayın. Aramayınız. Can means don't call. Aradım cevap yok. Aradım cevap yok. Means I called but there was no answer. Aradım ama bulamadım. Aradım ama bulamadım. It means I looked for it, but I couldn't find. Okay, guys, we came to the end of the 40 verbs. Um, I really got tired. <laughs> um, I hope you have taken your notes. And if this video was useful for you, please don't forget to like. And... If you haven't subscribed, make sure that you subscribe and ring the bell because I don't know when I'll put another video for you. So when another video comes up, you'll be notified. Okay, dear students, good luck.